Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's public feud with Prince Charles over finances has been uncomfortable for the public, according to royal commentator Scott Henderson. During their Tell All Oprah interview, the Duke of Sussex said that his father had literally cut me off financially after the couple stepped down from the royal family. Scott Henderson told Sunrise, There's a lot of good to come out of Harry and Meghan doing this Oprah interview, conversations about race and mental health. When it comes to finances, it feels awkward. It feels like we're at a family barbecue and there's a huge public squabble. It's uncomfortable and it really needed to be handled behind closed doors and not with Oprah as a mediator. Harry and Meghan appeared with Oprah in March for a two-hour bombshell interview, where they detailed their reasons for leaving the royal family. During the interview, Prince Harry attacked his father for cutting the couple financially adrift and for refusing to take his calls. This left the couple dependent on the money Princess Diana had left Harry after she died and had left them with no option but to seek lucrative deals with media companies in order to ensure their financial independence. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have signed deals with Spotify and Netflix that are estimated to be worth £100 million. However, Royal Expenditure reports that were published on Thursday show that Prince Charles had been supporting the couple until last summer. In the financial year beginning April 2020, he provided Prince William, Prince Harry and their families with £4.5 million. Clarence House clarified that a substantial sum had been allocated to Harry and Meghan to help them transition from their royal roles. When asked about Prince Harry's remarks to Oprah, a spokesperson said I wouldn't acknowledge that they are dramatically different. All I can tell you are the facts. This expenditure report differs from Harry and Meghan's account that the royal family had severed financial ties with the couple following their January 2020 Megshi announcement. Their interview with Oprah also saw the couple criticize the royal family for their lack of support towards mental health and Buckingham Palace's reluctance to correct damaging tabloid articles that circulated about the Duchess. The most shocking allegation was that an unnamed member of the royal family had made a racist remark about the skin color of their unborn child. Harry and Meghan are now financially independent and reside in Montecito, California with their two young children, Archie and Lilibet.